So we have four ATA degrees, that's a two-year degree, but they all start out with a very strong basis in horticulture. The first year is horticulture soils, plant ID, pruning, all of the really basic elements of a horticulture education. Then once someone has completed that first year, they're going to make a choice. They can go into design or installation and maintenance, or they can choose a nursery specialization, or they can choose the restoration horticulture degree. Horticulture here at the college has been um, a long continuing tradition of getting into landscaping, into nursery, into maintenance, into uh, greenhouse production. Uh, we venture into uh, sidelines with uh, optional classes to um, extend to the community as well. Our classes are a real variety of both hands-on and lecture mode, which I think the students really enjoy and I know I enjoy teaching outdoors all through the year. We get outside, we're building things, we're planting things, we're visiting sites, we're meeting clients, and this is a great way to learn. One of the things that drew me to horticulture and I think really interests our students is that it's a perfect blend of art and science, both together. The science borrows from other sciences like botany and chemistry and ecology and geography so it gives us the opportunity to learn a little bit about a whole bunch of interesting areas and the art part of it is how do we learn to work with plants in a sensitive way and to nurture their growth it's so gratifying to have both of those things come together in a profession like horticulture so many of our students come into the program with the desire to own and run their own business and because of the way we teach it's project-based, it's, it's uh, lots of real-world kind of experiences. When they finish the program, many of them do just start right off running their own business because they have the skills. It's been very gratifying to see a number of our students uh, go on to uh, uh, become very successful in this field. Some have written books, some have uh, uh, formed their own companies uh, from landscape businesses to nurseries, retail or wholesale. I'm a graduate of Edmonds Community College and I run a successful uh, landscape business here in the city. Um, we have 12 employees here and uh, we do design, build and maintenance. I don't think I could have got here unless I had uh, the education I did at Edmonds Community College. My degree gives me a lot of credibility. Uh, and I can say I'm a graduate of Edmonds Community College and that holds a lot of weight in the horticulture uh, world. My time at Edmonds was very uh, interesting, challenging and fun. I made a lot of friends and we keep in touch after all these years and I'm very sure that they are lifetime friendships. So really everything that I took there is something that I can draw on any given moment when I'm working and Edmonds has a very special place in my heart.